Well, they're all big games, aren't they? Now every week's a big game, and uh, it's four games left, possibly f- possibly five. Um, we need to make sure we we're, we're at the best of, of our abilities. We make, need to make sure that we've got people rested who are keen to play, but also making sure we're picking strong enough teams to to carry on winning games. What do you make to the threat of Bath? And we saw them here in December. It was a great game between the two teams. What do you think about them at the moment? They've obviously progressed throughout the season. Yeah, Bath, Bath are a great club and they've got a lot of good players and got good coaching staff. Um, they, they've played some real good rugby, they've ground some results out in, in tough games. Um, they've got a good pack of forwards and some quality backs and some good kickers, so it, it's going to be a tough game on their pitch, it always is. Um, we need to we need to be at our best to, to be able to compete. Have you been impressed with their development up front this season? Because it was always an area where they might have lacked a little bit sometimes, but do you think this season they've really grown up front as well? Yeah, we won't forget the fact that they came here and they mauled us over the line, I think, and they scrummed us over the line and, and they caused us a lot of problems. So uh, that's in the forefront of our, our memories and, and we need to make sure we go there and we give a good account of ourselves. No, a really good performance uh, against the inform Harlequin side that have been playing some really good rugby and I think uh, our defence held up and we, we played well. Yeah, you talk about the defence, it was a massive defence effort from the boys, wasn't it really, to restrict them to 10 points with players that they've got, obviously Mike Brown and Danny Kerr, things like that. Yeah, it was huge, they've got a lot of playing threats and uh, I thought we, we dealt with them really well. How do you feel about the sort of progression then of the, of the team since the boys have come back from internationals and, like that, and they've, they've obviously got back in, because obviously you lot were, were here already, um, you, you won those 13 games in a row, uh, how do you feel it's, it's sort of shaping up towards the month of May? I think that we're getting some really good momentum week on week. We get better, um, as like as I said at the weekend, uh, we we played well. Everyone seems to be gelling, and we're playing a good style of rugby. And for yourself, how are you feeling about your own form? You've obviously been involved quite a lot this season. Yeah, playing a bit of loose head now because of injuries. Uh, Ethan with his hand, which is a shame, but uh, just having to step in and uh, get back, get the loose head boots back on. I haven't played there for a couple of years, but. It's good to learn both positions really as a as a young front rower, so enjoying it. So when you were coming through then at Rotherham, were you learning both positions at the same time or what, what was it how was it going? No, when when I was at Leeds I always was a loose head. Um and then when I went to Rotherham I uh, had a year at tight head, so that was my first year last year at tight head. Um so still quite young at tight head to be honest, but enjoying it and getting better. So hopefully. you probably actually played more loose head than you did tight head? Yeah, in the, yeah, in the past yeah, so yeah, I've played a lot of loose head. That's a good, I suppose it's a good option, isn't it? Because obviously, as you say, unfortunately Ethan's now injured and you've got Alex there and obviously Alex Corbusier is coming back as well. So it's nice that you've got that versatility, I suppose. Yeah, it's always good in a squad to have people that can play both because, like we said, injuries happen and um, I'll, I'll be able to cover that, so that's quite good news. Do you feel quite comfortable getting back into that? Was it, was it quite comfortable last week when you came on and played it? Uh, rusty. Um, I wouldn't say comfortable. It's it is it's totally different to tight head, and I haven't really played loose head for a long time. But I, d- I do know how to play there, so it's it's okay.